Hey Henry, he's having a little wriggle. Say hi. Everything stops. We were enjoying a fantastic boxing day at my mum's and then what we thought were Braxton Hicks contractions got worse. Phoned the hospital and they said to come in. And at that moment, everything changed. Nobody prepares you for this feeling of being pregnant to not being pregnant and not having your baby in your arms. For me, that was the most difficult thing I've ever experienced. We couldn't really touch him or hold him while he was in his incubator. There's lots of memories, sights and sounds that you wish you could actually erase, but I think the hardest part of it all was not being able to take them out and show them off to the world. Um, they can't meet your closest friends and family. There's just all these things that you would take for granted as being a, a new parent that you realise you, you just can't. When my baby was born, I thought he's going to be in an incubator, that's going to be it. Maybe I'll be able to put my hand in and stroke him and caress him. But the day after he was born, one of the nurses said, do you want to hold your baby? And I just burst out crying. I remember the priest was going to be there at eight o'clock and this was at about seven. And I said, these numbers aren't great. Uh, how long? Because I said, uh, the priest won't be here in time. At times it can feel a bit too much. It makes you feel quite isolated, quite lonely, but it shouldn't be the case because it's important to reach out for help, for support from organizations like police, family, friends. There's so many families that experience this as well every year in the UK. And most importantly, you must feel supported.